Hey, Editing Teresa here. I had just picked up my camera. This was taken on March 14th. Just decided to uh, give you all an update, seeing how it's been like a long time since I've uh, put anything up on the channel. Just a quick update of what's going on, and uh, let's get into the video. Good morning. It is currently just about 8 o'clock in the morning, and it's been a very long time since I've been on here. I just want to show you what's been going on since I've been away. This is a quick look at the garden right now. We don't have much in here. I've been um, behind, at least a month behind. That's a volunteer, some flower. That's just a succulent that's there temporarily. And over here, I've got some potatoes planted. As you can see, they're starting to come up, but I am going to get some more soil and cover them. And then I'm really happy because for the first time, I sow carrots and they're actually coming up. All in here. So I'm gonna sow another row. And then over here, I've got garlic with a volunteer seeded simpson lettuce over here i have okay so red onions white onions leeks which i've never had success with and i don't know i'm going to this year and shallots which i've never grown before and then i had a few extra of the onions so i went ahead and threw them in here so we got red onions in here with some alyssum and some white onions in here with alyssum, but the alyssum's not really good. Over here, I have some strawberries. Um, these were bare root strawberries and they look like they're doing really well. Take a quick look around here. They're doing really well, really well. I feel like there's some, oh, over there. Beautiful. Just keeping all the bugs off of that one, huh? And then down at the bottom, I tran this one doesn't look like he's doing well, so he does have a green leaf right there. So I am holding out hope. Holding out hope. And this one down here was transplanted from another spot in my garden, and he's got a flower. So holding out hope there. Oops. This is part of my rainwater catchment. And then, oh, and the reason, the reason why I've been behind is I had to drive out to California to get these guys. That's Astrid, and somewhere over here is Eo. So they've been making it really hard for me to get caught up on everything. And then... So everything may be coming, going late. I don't know, but, and over here, this is all the lettuce. This, I don't know if it's lettuce, but it sprouted. So over here, I'm trying to grow some, it might be too late, like I said, I don't really know. I'm trying to grow some arugula, some seeded Simpson, some flamingo spinach, butterfly spinach, and then just some, um, just regular salad spinach. And, and that's all I've got going so far. Like I said, I'm like two months behind. We'll see what happens. Oh, wait, let me show you the inside. And on the seed station, I did start some tomatoes. I don't know what the best angle for this. It's in a very tight spot. So I have these tomatoes. I started Ace 55 from M.I. Gardener. Pink Berkeley tie-dye, Atomic Grape and Black Beauty. Oh God, I know, all uh, from Boar Head, Boar, Boar Farms, Boar Head Farms. I don't remember what the name of it is exactly. And I did start some peppers. The, these two are bell peppers. That's a bell pepper also. And then those ones in the back are either jalapenos or poblanos. And the eggplants and the, either the jalapenos or poblanos, I don't know. They didn't, they didn't take. Them, because I started, uh, so late that maybe um, 
That, maybe that could be why things aren't actually growing. But I don't know. I'm just going to have to do my best and see what happens. Where do I look? See what happens. Um, better late than never. I mean, things are going to... I have a better chance of things growing than if I don't plant them at all. So we're a couple months late, but we're not giving up. And that's the update for today. Thank you. Uh, please, you know, do all the things if you want to subscribe, like, let other people know I'm out here. Uh, thanks. Bye.